Hi there guys, um, this is just a quick little giveaway um, for 50 subscribers, um, basically I've hit 50 subscribers already within a matter of 3 weeks which I'm really over the moon with, so I'm going to do a small survival and just a bit of fun kind of fishing giveaway kit, um, if you'd like to be in the chance for this giveaway all you've got to do is like this video, subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel. Um, basically, you've got some size 16 hooks there tied to nylon already. Uh, a wire trace with a couple of with a treble and a single hook for dead baiting. Uh, a small spinner for um, trout, small pike, maybe a perch. Uh, there's also some fake floating baits there tied to nylon hooks already. Some split shots, um, some homemade floats that I've made myself. Um, hopefully you'll find them all right. I find them fine. I use them quite often down rivers and small streams and stuff. Um, there's also a box of hooks in there. There is also, I don't know if you can see, but there's some quick snap links there. Um, there's also a plummet. So you'll have a plummet to test depths and things. A small ledger. Uh, more of a survival thing really now is some eyelets to put into a branch if you haven't got a rod or you want a rod basically just uh, screw that into the end of the t into the tip of your rod so that's poking down gives you an eye on a branch um, you can do two or you can do three some people prefer three some people prefer two some people just like one safety pin <coughs> excuse me the little pot that it comes with Two range bands, basically there's a, a fair bit of, uh, I think it's eight pound line on there. Everything here fits inside this pot. Everything, a whole lot. So it will be coming in that pot. Um, also, in, the pot will then go inside this bag. Generally, I can fit a small to medium trout in this bag. Once I've caught it, just slip it in, string the knot up, string the uh, tie up, and I can put it back in the water and keep it fresh until I've caught a secondary one. If that's what you want to do. You could use it for something else if you wanted to. Um, I mean you could, if you're just fishing for coarse fish, I suppose you could put some bread in it. With a stone in the bottom. Put a bit of line, paracord attached to the top. Zip that up so it's nice and tight. Chuck it out and let the, the waves of the river and that whip it around and it'll let bread out of it. As you can see, there you go, um, it all fits in there quite nicely, you can't really see, it's quite dark. Uh, I forgot to say earlier, this pot is covered in insulation tape as well, just in case you need it for anything such thing. Um, and like I say, if I can get this in with one end. Just literally drop that in there, cinch it up. And boom, there you go, done. Carry it away, however you like. Um, but yeah, like I say, uh, just subscribe and like this video. Subscribe to the channel. 